Good morning, everybody, and happy Aloha Thursday. We have nice conditions ahead of us for today, but weaker winds coming through for Kauai and Oahu. So a land breeze, sea breeze pattern taking over for us, whereas Big Island, Maui County, your weather pattern not expected to change much. Big Island, especially, at least winds to 20 miles an hour. Maui County may see some of the converging winds later in the day. We're looking at a state forecast high of about 82 to 84 degrees, so we are going to be warming up, and without our trade wind flow here, for the far western end of the state, it's going to be feeling a bit warmer. But you can see a lot of clarity out there, gorgeous conditions to start off the day. As the cold front's approaching us, we're going to be seeing our winds shifting, not just a bit lighter, but also a bit more out of the south. So bringing that southeasterly component pretty much statewide, aside from uh, Hawaii Island. So Big Island still seeing an east-northeast flow, but as that frontal boundary approaches us, it's also dissipating. And as it weakens, it's forecast to continue to lift to the north of the state, passing to our north in terms of the majority of the moisture associated with it, but it's impacting our winds at least through tomorrow. We'll start to see a trade wind flow thanks to a high-pressure system that'll fill in behind that frontal boundary. And that'll deliver us winds re relatively strong Saturday into Sunday, breezy conditions to 25 miles an hour. But Yet another cold front is going to be arriving. And that one, not only is it going to be shifting our winds, but it looks like we may, might see a little bit more moisture associated with that frontal boundary as it passes over us. Now, in terms of rainfall, the radar has been very inactive. In the overnight, very early morning hours, we saw some windward showers for Maui, but a lot of those have even lightened up. So it's a dry start to the day. Most places expected to be remain dry, remaining dry as the day progresses, but some of those interior sections are going to be see, seeing those sea breezes deliver a few, at least clouds, if not some showers. Ra rain chances do bump up, close to about a 20 to 30 percent chance of rain, so not extremely high, but higher than what will start the day out with variable winds today and tomorrow trades back Saturday Sunday and they're gone again on Monday that's like your weather and I'll send it on out to surf news network Gary Cooley who's all you need to know on your surf front today hey good morning GQ good morning Kelly well we're looking at really fun waves again three to five on the North Shore everywhere's breaking it's not big it's not small one to three out at Makaha there could be a set Really good for now, but it will experience sea breezes. Southern shores flat to one. There's no south swell, but it is coming up to three feet this weekend on an out-of-season event. One barely to a diamond head. It's not crowded because there's hardly any waves. Two feet at Sandy's. Makapu'u one to two with a few pluses. And again, those light, light trade winds trying to fill into a moderate pace. Big swells coming for Saturday and the kickoff of the World Championship Tour at the Pipeline. That's right, the Billabong Pro Pipe will go in this 10-foot Northwester marching our way right now. Well, the high tides at, towards lunch, a minus low tide near dinner, a sunset at 618 and rising at 709.